I'm also deeply mindful of how angry we are as Californians about what's going on in the streets and sidewalks in our state. We know that housing is a crisis um, right now, and so we need to build more housing. We need to make sure we can immediately get people off the streets as quickly as we can and, and have a pathway also to that permanent housing. And so this is an important step in the process. I know that we as a legislature are going to be working really hard to make sure that we are also fighting for the permanent housing that's needed in the district too. It's so hard to see the progress, I think, partly because people are struggling right now. You know, housing is more expensive than it's ever been for folks. People are struggling in this economy with inflation. And so, you know, in L.A., for example, we're housing over 200 people a day, but we are, you know, having people more than that fall into homelessness every day, right? So this is going to take a big, you know, chunk, a big piece of what we need to be doing and making sure that we're housing people as quickly as we can. But we have to do all the things. We have to do prevention. We have to do permanent housing. We have to do, you know, interim housing. We have to do all the things to really address the crisis as it is. Within the next couple of weeks, we're going to be putting out $1 billion of awards by the end of this calendar month to the cities and counties to put those dollars to work to make real the commitments they've made in these plans.